When light passes from an image, it travels through the lens of the eye and lands on the film of the back of the eye which is called the retina. If our eye is pointing straight, the light will land on an area of the retina called the fovea. This part of the retina is our area of central vision, and light must focus here in order for us to see an image clearly. In a patient with an inward turning eye, or esotropia, one eye points straight and the other eye turns in. When this occurs, the area of central vision from the straight eye is pointed towards the image we are looking at. The area of central vision of the eye that is turning will point towards another image. This can result in double vision. If children are young when the eye turn first occurs, they may not always report double vision because children may not realize that it isn't normal to see this way. Instead, Parents may observe their child covering an eye, closing their eye, or turning their head in an attempt to make the double vision go away. Because double vision is uncomfortable, the brain will usually adapt over time so that we ignore the information from the eye that is turning. This helps to resolve the double vision, but it also impairs the ability to develop normal visual skills, such as tracking and focusing in the eye that turns in. In addition, if children are relying on visual information from only one eye, they will often have poor depth perception, which may result in reduced coordination. Many cases of inward eye turns are caused due to high hyperopia, which is a strong glasses prescription. When the patient is not wearing glasses, they have to use the muscles in their eyes to focus through their prescription in order to see clearly. This over-focusing can pull the eyes inward resulting in an eye turn. Glasses can often be prescribed to straighten the eyes. However, certain visual skills such as depth perception, visual acuity, or eyesight, tracking or focusing may not be properly developed. If these skills are not developed, it can make it more challenging for the brain to process visual information from both eyes and can result in our brain ignoring the information from the eye that is turned even after the eyes appear to be straight with glasses. The brain often has to be taught how to perform visual skills, such as focusing and tracking effectively in order for proper eye alignment and depth perception to be achieved. If surgery is performed before these skills are in place, children may be at risk of requiring additional surgeries or may continue to have reduced eye alignment or depth perception once surgery is complete. Visual skills such as focusing, tracking, and eye alignment can be improved through vision therapy. Vision therapy is like physiotherapy for your eyes. Activities which are supervised by a doctor of optometry will help to build the necessary visual skills to allow the brain to process the information from both eyes at the same time. As patients progress through their vision therapy program, they are able to strengthen the muscles in their eyes so that they are able to keep them straight. Patients can often achieve improved eye alignment without the need for surgery. Because patients also improve additional visual skills, such as eye focusing, depth perception, tracking and peripheral vision, patients will also often report improved reading performance, comprehension and coordination throughout the course of a vision therapy program. Eye turns are easily detected during a routine eye exam. However, if esotropia is detected, a more comprehensive binocular vision assessment is important in order to determine the best treatment options. This assessment involves additional testing that is not performed during a routine eye exam. Please contact our office at 780-444-6407 for more information or to schedule a comprehensive binocular vision assessment.